Biology Role Model Project, Craig Ventier, by Parker Wainio. Growing up, Craig had very little interest in education, let alone the sciences. According to The Atlantic, he described himself as unengaged, mostly getting C's and D's in his classes. Growing up with a drunk father, Craig left his home soon after graduating, moving to Newport Beach, California. There he picked up a love of surfing and boating. Boating had always been a massive hobby for Craig, along with surfing, and later in life he circumnavigated the globe multiple times on his ship Sorcerer II. While in California, he was drafted into the Vietnam War. Craig opposed the war, but he still enlisted. According to Craig's autobiography, A Life Decoded, he joined the U.S. Navy, working in a Vietnam field hospital in the intensive care ward. The ward was a massive obstacle for him to overcome. In fact, he almost didn't. Wanting to commit suicide and end the horror that he saw in Vietnam, Craig swam out to swam out to ocean over a mile, wanting to get washed away by the waves. However, he changed his mind and swam back. At the hospitals, he saw the horrors of war and developed an interest in science, specifically medical science, in order to help those around him. Craig is an incredibly interesting person, although one not without his fair share of controversies. Craig's desire to help along with his dedication to do so is very admirable. His desire to help is something I identify with. He has spent nearly his entire life working towards this goal and the advancements of genetics. In 2014, he founded the Human Longevity, Pro uh, Human Longevity Incorporation with the purpose of using genetic sequencing to figure out how people can live longer and healthier lives. His controversies do have to be noted, however. While he does desire to help people, it might not strictly be out of the goodness of his heart. He angered the entire scientific community when he tried to patent his discovery, the, the discoveries made in expressed sequence tags. However, the enraged scientific community quickly shut these patents down. Mentier is a major name in the field of genetics. He is most, no he is most known for his work sequencing the human genome, but that is by no means the only thing he's done. Besides his work on the Human Genome Project, he was the first to sequence the genome of an individual using his own genetics for the project. He also led the Global Ocean Sampling Expedition with the purpose of documenting the genetic diversity of microbiomes in the ocean. According to the New York Times, the question he wants to answer most is how genetics can be used for the betterment of human life. This is seen with the company he created, Human Longevity, that, answer, that tries to answer just that question. The most recent paper Venter, Ventier is authored under is from January uh, 10, 2020, published in Genome Medicine, titled An Unsupervised Learning Approach to Identify Novel Signatures of Health and Disease for Multimodial Data. The experiment saw the use of nearly 1,400 points of data from over 1,200 individuals with the purpose of using machine learning methods to identify biomarkers of health and disease risks. The main technique used in this was machine learning, and the purpose of this is the desire to see machine learning used in healthcare fields in the future. Vintier has left his name etched into the world of genetics due to his discoveries made on the Human Genome Project, the Individual Genome Project, the Global Ocean Sampling Expedition, and the multiple companies founded over the years. In 2018, he stepped down as the CEO of Human Longevity. However, he is still serving as president of the J. Craig Venter Institute, and although not retired, he still enjoys his hobby of boating. And the sources used for this were the God, was the article published in The Atlantic, The God of Small Things, the article published, uh, or sorry, um, the autobiography of Craig Ventier, A Life Decoded, the article published in the New York Times, Genetic Entrepreneur Sets His Sight on Aging and Death, and then the research paper uh, Craig Ventier is uh, authored under.